Bobby Lopez here, and when it comes to the uh, the top players in the world, I guess we're talking about Phil and Tiger, and it's no different for the other guys. They're rolling 164 foot putts every day, every day. And they've been playing since they were three, four, five years old, and they're still rolling four foot putts every day. So there must be something to it. You're going to find that this whole game is nothing but get it within the four foot circle and make it. Whether you're trying to chip it into a four-foot circle or you're rolling a long putt into a four-foot circle or you're knocking it out of the bunker into a four-foot circle or you're 180 yards away from the green and you're trying to hit it within a four-foot circle, it's get it within four feet and make it. Now, both Tiger and Phil make a perfect circle like this. Now, I, you know, I don't like that method, but, you know, who am I to, to, uh, to, uh, to criticize these guys? They're making more money than me. There's also this method, which is what I use. What I've done is staggered the balls because I don't think you get a four-foot putt every time. So sometimes you got a two-footer, sometimes you got a six-footer, sometimes you got a three-footer, sometimes. So I've, I've made every one of these balls. It makes it look weird, sort of like a star, I guess, a little bit, because they're all different distances. Now Arnie was famous for this one right here. Arnold Palmer used to always do the, you know. You start off with this putt, this one's a little longer, that one's a little longer, this one's a little longer, a little and so on, all the way around. So each putt got a little longer. I don't like that as well either because your mind already knows, hey, you know, I'm going to roll it just a little bit faster this time, and it's too easy to get used to it. I like that. Stagger them around, it looks silly, but uh, I think it's a better idea. But what can I tell you? These guys use that right now, perfect four-foot circle, but I'll tell you, I don't think it matters as much which one of these three ideas you use, I think what matters is that you do it. And you can practice right on your, your living room floor, unless you've got a shag carpet or something. But if you have a, a fairly tight carpet, you can putt right on there. And uh, you can putt at work, too, if your boss plays golf. And, and just work from a four-foot circle and work on club face control. That's the whole idea here. Can you point the club face? Can you point the club face exactly at where you're going?